The life of heating aids is not easy. We use them every day and they are exposed to all sorts of nasty stuff. Sweat, rain, dust, earwax, beauty products, dirty hands, and all kinds of accidents. So when is it enough? In this video, we're going to get inside one of the most fascinating places in GN. Behind these walls, there is a gigantic torture chamber where we test all our hearing aids in extreme conditions. And I want to find out how easily can my hearing aids break. Jabuz, help me to understand what you do here. Here in this part of the GN, we test your hearing aid devices okay. to make sure that they are protected. Hearing aids, chargers, accessories, everything we are sending to our customers. And specifically here, we test some mechanical tests. If you give me your hearing aids... I don't know if I want to, but here you go. I, I trust you. Thank you very much. You wanna shoot, Mika? That one? Uh, ah, that didn't sound good. I don't yeah. wanna see it. And you will see it in slow, slow motion. Oh. Wow. I, I didn't know that hitting heads could bend like that. Yeah, it works very solid, but actually it's flexible and it's important because it's a kind of protection. So, so it, helps to, it helps to protect the heating aid exactly. from the impact. Yes. You ready for further tests? More things, more? Okay, yes. I'm ready. So this is like a fancy washing machine where the heating aids are spinning. Hearing aid, accessories, chargers. Everything, everything we produce. Everything goes to the washing machine. And, and you are testing for random faults? Random faults, they are heating to each other, side walls and fallen from one meter high. Sometimes up to 100 times. Yes. Sorry, Camila, I'm late, but the weather was terrible. But then you're in the right place because here we make sure that you can wear your hearing aids in difficult weather conditions. All GN hearing aids offer the maximum level of protection IP68. A 6 means that your hearing aids are so well sealed that not even dust can get in. The 8 indicates that the hearing aids can be immersed in water for long periods of time without damage. Does it mean that your hearing aids are waterproof? You see, in GN, we don't like to use the word waterproof because it gives the impression that you can do anything you want without consequences. It is like the airbag in your car. The fact that you have an airbag doesn't make your car accident-proof. Accidents happen and therefore, we prefer to say that your hearing aids are water resistant or weatherproof. One of the biggest enemy uh, for, the, for the electronics is actually uh, salt, which okay. is, for example, when we sweat. Here in this test, we expose our hearing aids to very, very salty conditions. For example, when you run. Oh no, you are evil. You can give it a go. Let me try. So how much? Just like uh, Just how go I for feel? It. Just go for it. This is where my culinary... A little bit more. I think it's ready to go. So now we leave our hearing aids for many, many days. We monitor their performance. And after the test, we take the devices out, open them, look closely into what happened. And if something happened that we don't like, for example, corrosion, we go back to the design board and change or optimize the design.
to here, you can simulate things that happen in the real life exactly. of the hearing aids. It's for example, for storage, transportation, highly humid conditions, anything. And how long does it take? We usually are testing for a weak points in the design, so it can take even up to a few months. What advice would you give to people to take care of their hearing aids? Keep them dry, keep them out of the excessive heat, do not walk into the shower with them. If anything happens, consult with your HCP. Really, really take care of them because they are sensitive. Until now, you have seen how we protect the hearing aids. Mm -hmm. In my team, we focus on the safety of the end user. Remember, people are wearing hearing aids for the whole day in skin contact. Therefore, we make sure that there is no side effect like skin irritation or allergic reaction. Can people be allergic to hearing aids? It's very rare, but it's not impossible. Okay. People can be allergic to many things and medical devices are no exception. Mm -hmm. Therefore, hearing aids are made from materials that are tested according to international standards in order to minimize the risk. So, which parts of my hearing aids are tested? housing of the hearing aid, the cable, receiver, the dome which goes directly into the ear, but also the charger, so the housing of the charger, the inserts of the charger, all of the components that are in skin contact. So what do you think? Hearing aids are not indestructible, but damn, they can do amazing stuff. It's great to see how much care EM puts into every detail to give you the best experience. The world is full of beautiful sounds and your hearing aids should not prevent you from enjoying every moment. Ah, oh, come on! Well, life happens.